There is a famous saying that life is not a bed of roses. So, it's mean that many of the daily life situations may become the reason of sadness in your life. No one is actually 100% free from sadness. Do you agree? Sometimes the behavior of people hurts you. Sometimes a business loss or a cancel trip and much more. If you are a student, then an evil result may cause sadness in your life. Always remember that a single bad day doesn't mean a bad life. But there are other ways to reduce your sadness, anger and upset mood. Keeping inside all these situations, our today video is going to share with you the ways to cope with sadness. So, the first one is Distract yourself If possible, do your best to distract yourself from overthinking. The thoughts are your enemy when sadness sets in. Play with the pet or go for a walk. Read a book if you are able to focus or finish a puzzle. Do anything that takes your mind off your fears and worries. Connect with friends. This can be one of the hardest things to do when feeling depressed, but it is one of the most rewarding activities. Isolating oneself from others may seem a good idea, but put a limit on it. This can have a huge positive effect on your mood. Get enough sleep. Sleep and mood are closely related and interconnected. Studies have shown that even partial sleep lag has a significant effect on mood. The quality of your sleep directly affects the quality of your working life, including your mental sharpness, efficiency, emotional balance, creativity, physical energy and even your weight. No other activity delivers so many benefits with so little effort, so aim for between 7.5 and 9 hours sleep per night. Forgive others when we hold a bitterness, we are the one that feels the anger. The person whom we are angry makes us upset. So, don't allow others to have this power over you. They may have caused you grief in the past. Try not to allow that grief to continue. It only affects you, not them. Find a way to forgive. They are not worthy of your time. Practice Mindfulness Mindfulness involves focusing on the present moment and is a skill that needs to be practiced. More often than not, our brain is full of thoughts and focusing on the present moment seems unnatural for our mind. Practice on engaging your senses in the moment. Focus on senses, engaging the senses leave less time for worry. Stop the negative self-talk. Upset people tend to see the world in a negative way. When things go wrong, you blame yourself and when they go right, they put it down to luck. Don't take your thoughts seriously when you are feeling low. Accept the thoughts but this doesn't mean that you have to believe them. Eat or drink something delicious. Eating delicious food and drinking coffee, tea or a juice may diminish your sadness level. because they reset your immune system and in the same way the thinking level.
so mention in the comment box whether you choose any of the way thank you for watching our video to like share and comment and don't forget to subscribe our channel